A certified green business, Andreas's pick focuses on local, sustainable, and made from scratch modern German fare. It also boasts the largest selection of German beers in the East Bay. In Berkeley, it's called Gelman Kitzel German Restaurant. Here we go. In the beginning, opening the restaurant, I was always on the phone with my grandma. I wanted to make sure I don't lose any recipes, and she's still looking over my shoulder and telling me, don't do it this way, it's a shortcut, do it this way, it's better. Schönen guten Tag, my name is Anja, and this is Kai, my husband. We are the owner of the German restaurant Gaumen Kitzel in Berkeley. So no red cabbage, please? So Gaumen Kitzel got its name in memory of my grandpa. And when we were eating, he said, hmm, what a Gaumen Kitzel. So Gaumen Kitzel actually means literally translated, tickle your taste buds. German cuisine is very versatile. Kai, my husband, he's from the south of Germany. This is where we got all the southern influenced dishes like sweet dumplings, spätzle, breaded schnitzel, more the hardy dishes. I'm from Hamburg. The cuisine in Hamburg is very influenced by fish, fresh fruit, even dry fruit and spices. It can be very light, you can have a lot of vegetarian dishes. I often have people asking me where I got all my energy. I actually get it from all the guests. Oh, that's They're really supporting and asking for specials. So I'm challenged to get that right for them. You speak German. I do right? actually, yes. All right, so how's my Gaumann Kitzel? Is that? The pronunciation is excellent. <laughs> it's actually. excellent. It's excellent. My family is from Hamburg, and that is where the owners are from. So the cooking is more traditional northern German rather than kind of the southern German cooking that you have in most German restaurants in the Bay Area. The ambiance is very nice. It kind of, you walk in and you kind of feel like you're maybe walking to a barn house. It has a very neighborhood feel. You mm -hmm. see a lot of families. Mm -hmm. uh, we actually tend to go for brunch there. We like to go for the nice hearty German breads and cheeses and, and the, they have a Bauernfrühstück. It's got eggs and bacon and everything mixed Bauern together. Frühstück. Bauernfrühstück. Farmers Everybody breakfast. Everybody come on. Yeah. Oh, 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 <laughs> working German. Yeah. Yeah. Just drink a little more beer. <laughs> And let's talk about the bread. It's a dollar bread. and it's worth it. And though. it is worth it. It is worth it. Let's I mean, talk about that bread. Well, German bread is, is hearty. Right. It's a rye bread and you just put the nice butter on it. It's It's got consistency to it. What did you think? What Can was your I experience? just talk about the bread? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the bread, you know, because you kind of get put off, you know, it's like a dollar for bread. Everyone serves bread for free. You know, I would have paid $10 for the bread. <laughs> the bread was so good because it's the crust is really crunchy and the inside is just like this chewy chewiness, wonderful bread. I've grown up eating German bread. This is some of the best bread. Well, where did you go from the bread? Uh, went to the smoked pork chops. Smoked oh, pork chops wow. are over the top, so good. Perfect combination of smokiness and saltiness. They serve it with uh, sauerkraut, absolutely perfect. A little bit of sourness to meld with the, the smokiness and the saltiness. Served with mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes were creamy, oh, done perfectly. Amazing. Perfect dish. Did you absolutely have that perfect. dish as well? Oh, yeah. oh God, it was so God. good. <laughs> oh, my oh my gosh. God. You need a fan? Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, we started off with the knockwurst and and cheese platter, which was unbelievable. I mean, this was so savory and delicious, and the cheeses were so creamy and scrumptious. It was just, you know, you couldn't eat enough of it. I also ordered the butternut squash soup, just absolutely delicious. Yeah. Oh, and speaking of the bread, they didn't. They ran out of the uh, whole wheat bread because I guess you must have been there right before. Oh <laughs> yeah, I ate all the bread. I'm sorry, I didn't bread. save you any. I ate it all. <laughs> so they oh. had uh, flaxseed mm. bread and as a replacement. I love flaxseed bread. It was one of the best I'd ever had. So from there, we ended up going on to the um, Jaeger schnitzel cut with the mashed potatoes that. <laughs> okay, now we do need a fan. Everybody yes, I, 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 yeah, I, I'm kind of traditionalist. Like a dish that I like the most is the pork loin and the creamy mustard sauce. If it's diced pork loin, kind of in a very rich, thick, creamy mustard sauce, it's done over a bit of spätzle, mm -hmm. which actually is a southern German uh, starch. It's an exquisite dish. I really feel like I'm sitting back 
in my grandmother's kitchen kind of eating the food that she used to make for us. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. Well, tell me a little bit more about what you had for your main course. We were really surprised by the rainbow trout. This fish was impeccable and I highly recommend it. It was salty, it was less than 48 hours old according to the wait staff. It was tender, it was juicy, we were really shocked. And then we also got the goulash. I thought that was a teensy tiny bit dry, but overall, it, you know, the red wine reduction sauce with the mushrooms and the creamy spetzla. Am I saying yes, that right? Yes. Uh, <laughs> it was, oh. We didn't know we were going to get a German lesson. <laughs> yeah. You know what? Yeah. I'm glad I got a German lesson. It was really fantastic. Yeah. yeah quite so the a goulash surprise. was an absolute hit. Yeah. Absolute hit. Yes. Now to wash all this down, of course, they are known for their beer list. I mean, they have some. They have about 14 or 15 beautiful German wine producers, but the beer list is extensive and well known. Yes, and, and I must say I'm a bit of a beer snob, and this is the only place in the Bay Area where they've actually poured a draft German beer properly. Mm. You need to have the proper amount of foam to the beer, so when you take that first sip, you kind of get that fluffy bitterness uh, combined with the rich texture of the beer itself, and it mixes really well. There you go. Service was absolutely perfect because yeah. we asked Service the waiter for some tips. I told him the kind of beer we like. He served me a beer that was absolutely delicious. The one thing I love about the beer, they have so many different beers on the menu and they have a, a very specific glass for every That's type of beer they right. have. And my wife ordered the, the flight of beers, so it comes on this laminated map of Germany with little arrows to where all the beers came from. I thought that was such a cool touch. What about pricing? We thought the pricing was very reasonable, especially for the level of service and the welcoming atmosphere, that it was just a perfect place to be able to have a conversation as well. You can really hear the person across from you. Very reasonably very priced. Very affordable. All right, very this affordable. is your spot, Andreas. Wrap it up for us. Well, I think it's a, a non-pretentious, authentic northern German cuisine. I think it has adventurous dishes, but they stay true to their northern German roots. Um, but to be honest, I would go back just for the beer alone. <laughs> All right. Jeannie? I would go back there in a heartbeat. All right, and Glenn? We went to dinner with my brother-in-law. He already announced he wants to go there for his birthday in December. <laughs> so it's a great restaurant. All right, if you would like to try Gelman Kitzel German Restaurant, it's located on San Pablo Avenue at Cowper Street in Berkeley. The telephone number is 510-647-5016. It's open for dinner Tuesday through Sunday with brunch on the weekends. Reservations are recommended, and the average dinner tab per person without drinks is around $30. Check Please Bay Area is made possible by the members of KQBD and by... Safe Catch Elite Wild Tuna. Great for athletes, kids, and pregnancy. Safe Catch tests each and every fish for mercury. Available at nearby stores. Walmart Global E-Commerce, with small, agile work teams, is focused on big data, engineering, and e-commerce innovations. Careers available at walmartlabs.com. Sutter Health CPMC, investing in community care for more than 150 years, including two new smart hospitals. Your city, your hospital. CPMC2020.org. Natural Mattress Systems from European Sleepworks, working to improve comfort and wellness for over 40 years. European Sleepworks in Berkeley, online at sleepworks.com. Oakland International Airport, now with flights all over the world. iFlyOAK.com. IRG has over 250 types of natural stone choices in stock today. IRG in Brisbane and Dublin or at marblecompany.com.